This went bad. Instability is interesting. I think, unfortunately for me, going damage, uh, or not damage, going defense is interesting if you have, like, a really strong parry build. Uh, but the regular parry chances, or even with, like, a defense of, what was that, 20? It didn't actually do me a whole lot of favors. I have the mushrooms, if I can live it. Uh... Well, this is near death. Let's see, anyway. I, you can't parry explosives, you can't parry... Who does damage? Shit, I'm so dead. Whee! Yep, I'm dead. Took way too much damage early on. Hey, thank you, Brian J, for the raid. That was life on your end. Okay, I'm probably gonna die here. Yup. Nope. Was that like a weird Google with a mustache? I think that was Google with a mustache there. Well. I get mad attack bonuses when I'm super injured. Which means currently. Careful maneuver. I don't think I'm going to be able to pull that off with that low of HP. But yeah, that was absolutely just Chrome with a mustache. Fair point. Okay. Go here. Shadow step. Well, grab these. Reduce current health to one. Gain five attack after completing three dungeons. I can swing that. Let's see. And there's no real reason for me to fight this. Okay. We get a halberd. So this is going to give me crazy damage if I can live. As a big if. Okay. Nope. Ugh, damn. That had potential, but yeah, I just didn't heal enough from the singular po potion to pull it off. Nah, these are boring. I like the axe. We'll go with the axe. I mean, it is also boring. But it is functionally boring. In a way that I can manage. Oof. Okay. Well, I do a ton of damage again. That last one would have been solid. But alas. Explode that. Heal a bit. You are mystery box to me. Lucky shoes or solidarity? Solidarity? Nah. Let's go lucky shoes. Hit this guy. He hurts, but I kill him. Rainer creature speed per hit. I like that. I wish the drain actually meant that I gained it for the rest of the uh, damage. It's my favorite item. I like the frozen tiara, which, of course... I pretty much never see and never get to use. Uh, but I've used it in the past and it is it's a lot of fun. Ah, shit. I thought I'd be able to get him before he got away. No dice. Is it the spirit crown? Maybe it is. I don't remember the name. 
unfortunately. Uh, yeah, sure, I'll take the stealth chance. Hand of dog? Is the hand of dog actually useful? It just looked like a bunch of bonus HP. I guess there was the speed element too. Okay, depends, yes. Okay, we've got that guy. I've got two healing potions. We might as well kill him. Good parry, no longer poisoned. Uh, let's create a random exit that isn't one of these. Embracing chaos. Sure. I rem uh, I remember it because it was if you have five or less items, you freeze on hit, right? Yes. That's why I like the frozen tiara. It's got some serious potential. Hand of Dog lets you pet dog during the creature stage. Oh, gotcha. Is this just kind of it? All right. I will not be killing that guy. Though I would like to. His defense is apparently, yeah, no, phase fiends. Well, it's a good thing there's no ranged attackers. Uh, do we not have any more mutations? Guess not. Volatile. Oh, that'll be fun. I want that stat point over there, but alas. Blow up the bomber men. Blow up him. That's fatal. So let's stay away from it. What else do we got? We're gonna switch a Ruzies. Gonna hit him once. Heal up. Kill him. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get through either of these guys, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna ignore it. Oh <sighs> well, let's start by killing that guy. The sooner he dies, the easier it is on me. Grab a detonate. I think I'll ignore that. Do I go for the glass shield? My defense is already pretty abysmal. But losing that maximum HP for three damage. That three damage, though. How fast is this damn snake? It's damn fast, but not that ridiculous. So do I go for the overwhelm or let's go for the crossroads. Let's see what it gives me. Instability ambush or a careful maneuver. Okay. So we got a careful maneuver, which is fine because high risk, high reward. I also can just explode everything immediately. Makes my life a lot easier. Damn it, he got away. There were two of them, though. Okay, so this gives me awareness and health. This gives me... Yeah, this is better. I think this worked out. Chug potions. Kind of wish I had the chuggy mask. I think it is actually just called the chugging mask, now that I'm thinking about it. It me.
Okay. So frustratingly... I have a shooty boy. We also have instability. Okay, we got lucky, which is good, because we needed to get lucky. So, I could do instability, but it's spooky as shit. Pop this open, let's see what we get. Spike shield is kind of exactly what I was looking for. Okay, now I can kill this guy. And we continue to disregard snake because screw it. Okay, let's grab these. I'm gonna grab tasty beans. Do I go for the instability? How much do I hate myself? A lot. Okay. So the exit is to the right. This is important. You're near fate. Near, not total. Chrysalis Heart is better than Amber. Thousand percent. Okay, my speed is higher, I attack first. I'm just kinda gonna let him go. Because there's a lot to be gained from this. And he doesn't actually do that much damage to me compared to what I, I am currently capable of doing. Okay, we're not going for that, though. That would be death. Alright, first and foremost, put this down. Shrine of Neglect. Ain't gonna help me, so I'm gonna ignore that one. Range creatures won't attack you. That's too good not to grab. Okay, I'm actually feeling pretty positive about this. What do I got? I got heals on one side. Okay, avoid, avoided that pretty well. Chance of awareness. Am I faster than Snek? No. Grab the barrier. Oh, this guy. I can feasibly kill him. Hello. Poison shield. Or bronze leaf. I'm actually feeling the bron bronze leaf is pretty good. Poison shield would be interesting. I got okay defense. And spike shield isn't helping me that much. So poison shield would be okay against certain enemy types. Actually, you know what? Better than that. Let's re-roll. Intimidate creature on hit. 40% chance to not just get slammed by things. I Up until now, I've kind of been eh on the idea of that. But the actual ex execution, I don't know, is possible. Do we want to give another instability a shot? I'm going to. It's risky, but if I can find a safe spot to kind of hang, we stay good. Gonna pop that. Unfortunately, that puts me in a bit of a pick in pickle land.
Okay. Pop that. Hit this guy. That way that doesn't hurt me. Because I, I can burn through a lot of these folks. And we've got heals for days. Literal days. Okay, now that I now that I understand how instability works. Freeze creature when hit. Oh, I mean. Clearly. how to feel about the chest plate. I think I'm going to give it a skip. Grab this. Grab create exit. Okay. Well, that works out for me. Yeah, I think I'm going to skip that. Yeah, that's my first legendary item and it's uh, kind of incredible. Okay, we get a Finder's Keepers, Enrage, plus 5 attack and splash damage this turn. Sure. I mean, no reason why not to. As a healing potion the other direction. Unfortunately... How much I can do here? Oh, good. Send them off. I'm almost as fast as this snack. Ah, it didn't work. Bam. Perfect. Okay, let's get over here, get him with Big Murder. There's Embracing Chaos, which has not screwed me over yet. Potions, some other things. I'm gonna pop this open. I've got a shit ton of souls. Maybe. I'm gonna pop it open. We got a couple of slots that can be filled. I'm going to grab the rapier. It's not amazing, but it's helpful. I'm going to hold on to create exit, and we're going to try and go into embracing chaos. I'd like to get the detonation scroll. Yeah, I don't have any pants yet. Oh, you're right. So yeah, I could actually just put this on, and there's no, no downside to it. Sorry, I was just assuming, you know, it's a beginner item. I don't need it. Can I harm this ham bone? I... Yeah. Unfortunately, we're going to have trap, trap door boys all the way down. Well, we got him. Ah, sneaky snack got me. We still have the detonate. But that's fine. We hit this neck. We do. Why is this neck so much faster than me? Always. Doesn't feel fair. Pop that. I'd like detonate. Oh, actually, yes. Pop the detonate. We get a shrine of neglect. Which I don't think I'm terribly keen on. Yeah, because that... That sacks stats to get a good item, maybe. Maybe Wander just likes exploring dungeons with no pants. How did you know me? Well, that worked out. Alright, what do you have for me? Versatile. Plus three to your high stat when equipped, or every dungeon has extra explosive creatures. Ugh. Go versatile. Speed's handy. Screw it. Let's grab the chest plate. Where are all 
of these guys Kaboomers? They're not. Big problem is there was a there was escape there was an escapee boy that I wanted to grab. Didn't get a good opportunity for it. Fine, bronze leaf. It's, it's that dodge chance. Do we want to lose two damage for ten percent dodge? Yeah, that's actually super good. Amorphous Mass. Half damage from melee attacks. You know, I'm gonna go with no. I've got high... I've got tons of defense. So most enemies can't hit me. Grab that one. Do we have any escapees? If we do, I do not see them. Upgrade seems kind of incredible. I guess we don't have any. Get out of here. Nope, never mind. He didn't get out of here. It's fine. Okay, so I do not want to replace either of these. I like them. Heal to one kill. I'm certainly in a good spot to make use of it. Oh, yes, I would like all of your souls. Okay. Upgrade, upgrade. Well, do we... I guess we might as well wait for a bit. I'll wait until I get the next scroll. The light. The light is cursed. Reflect on this. The shadow harbors clues you miss. You just don't strike me as a particularly beneficial dude. Okay, so not going to lie, this looks a little spooky. So I go over here. Well, grand scheme of things. If this shit is going to explode in my face, then so be it. Going for the rapier was a brilliant maneuver on my end. I'm going to pat myself hard on the back there. It is, it is back patting time. Uh, why do these look like they have a sense of finality here? Speed is higher. Suck it, Snack. Been a thorn in my side forever. All right, let's feed you. Turbulence of below X health freeze on attack. Nah. Tax deal plus one light damage per four health. Interesting. Healing missing health becomes light damage to all creatures. I'm gonna grab that. That might not be incredible. But it probably will be. Okay. So we've got patience. I wonder if I can actually murder those things. We're going patience. Let's see what happens. Can I kill this thing? Yes, maybe. I don't normally get to murder these guys. So this is kind of cathartic in and of itself. Because, yeah, I heal every time I kill something, so healing up to full gives me some good bits. 
Alright, I don't think I care about any of these. Grab that. You're useless. We've got one of these, but that's pointless. So let's grab, I like Volatile. Normally Volatile's a bit spooky for me, but I think we're in a good sp Holy shit, this game hit. Uh, a bit of a... Well, there's Detonate right there, but whatever. This hit a good rhythm. Volatile, you say? Hmm. Not really much of a thing. Unfortunately, no stack crystals. Grab that. I was kind of hoping that would blow up in my face. You've reached the stage that things start to get increasingly wild. I I like this stage. Attack targets get randomly teleported, or mimics get extra present extra choice. <sighs> They're good, but like I like the rapier. My Mimic's presenting an extra choice would be interesting. Is that a third item, then? I'm gonna re-roll them. I just kinda wanna see more. I mean, alternatively, Chaos Flower for just... Let's go Chaos Fla Flower for just... Extra nonsense. Alright, big splash. Okay, they'll explode. We get... I'm honestly not sure if this Healy scroll is going to be as good as I think it's going to be. Uh, yeah, I can pop this open. Mimic friend, dungeon items will all spawn in front of the dungeon. Yeah, I don't care about ranged creatures hitting me as much. So let's go for Mimic friend and skip that one. Don't need the potion. Get a random dungeon exit. Yeah, let's grab that. Let's see if I can bypass. Well, I've never been there before, so let's grab explosive and see what happens. Where does this lead me? Companions. I have a gift on one condition, quench the thirst, it's your addition. Weakness is a curse as well, do not worry, I won't tell. Quench the thirst, he says. Oh, I see. Kill the critter, what the hell is that? Alright, so the bad news is, I can kill this guy. How much Sam? So I'm I'm thinking we kill Sam. We kill all the critters. Okay. Here's the question. For those for those of you that hang out in chat. Well, okay. Better yet. Here's what we do. We kill all the critters, get the gift from Sam, then kill Sam. It is done. Here's your prize, a new disguise wear it proudly. Freshest hides. Fur coat. This sucks. Yeah, I don't think we help Sam in the future. Uh, eh, ooh, plus two defense, actually. That's pretty good. Bam. Ooh, hi. Yes, give me. Pull arm. Attack the next creature on pass, or attack a random creature on kill. Oh, shit. The problem is pull arm isn't that amazing. And Void Portal sounds good, but I like Living Helmet because it synergizes well with Light Concoction. So I'm going to re-roll these. Target 
both front cards on attack. That sounds incredible. Hello, I am here to fight everyone. Oh, you're spooky. Tasty beans. A little late for tasty beans. Okay. Uh, yeah, there's not really a whole lot of point in opening those up anymore. I'm going to go instability. Okay, let's grab some stats here. We grab an upgrade, which is just, I mean, I got it, right? Tipping point. Creatures with less than X health are frozen on hit. I mean, so it's okay. Anyway, time to start exploding everything. Watch, you're supposed to be stomping. That's meaningless. Die! I am the one who stomps. Uh, let's see, Poison Shield. I mean, honestly, probably better than Spike Shield at this point. Kind Not really, but we could absolutely replace my shield. My shield and, now that I'm looking at it, my necklace. My necklace is pretty shit. <laughs> oh, this is so good. Alright, let's pop you. Uh, mm. So this would let let me do 10 more damage, but we would lose the freeze on hit. That was not a necklace, actually. That was like a weird belt. I'm going to lose the versatile, I think. That was a necklace. It looked like one, but it was it was showing my belt as one of the alterna alternatives. Yeah, let's just save for the upgrade. Okay, what are you weird chaos void? Weird chaos void, in fact. Yeah, let's let's actually maybe save our pennies at this point. I could I could maybe get like one or two good things, but it's not gonna be much. Here's the other thing, I could actually kill the bird. What happens when the light shines bright? The world of beauty made anew for us to roam through me and you. Could I kill him? Yeah. Item will appear. Ambitious intent. And he is dead. We he heal up and we go through. I've got a lot. Owl is friend. Owl is dead! Item will appear. Gosh, my stats are going to be out of control. Okay, let's just pop this. Doesn't mean I pass up on a legendary item, but I uh, don't need it. What should I do? Favor of darkness, strike the creature, helpful now with hidden feature. New path. Alright. Looks like there's something kind of spooky in the back. Oh well. Oh, 
obviously I'm gonna have to be a little leery. Uh, let's actually pop the poison scroll, grab the fully heal. Okay, uh, let's kill everything first before I make any decisions here. What's that? Oh, it's stealing my souls. That's not acceptable. Uh, let's see if you got anything cool for me. Uh, let's see, I'm not feeling any of these. Or these. Still nor these. Give me an amulet, you... Bungus. Uh, I'll take frostbite. Okay, so it doesn't look like I I have a choice here. I have to light all of these. There's no light or dark. There's only death. I am chaos and damage incarnate. Who to trust? Well prepared. I already killed you. After all, you choose defiance. Why would you break our alliance? Betrayal's cost is far from free. Show yourself. Now you'll see me. Okay. All right, Brit man. Here's the thing. I am ridiculous. Oh, and it came pre-injured. Okay. Shit, that hurts. So the problem is it does 40 damage, plus it has a shit ton of armor pierce. So this does not put me in the ha happiest or the healthiest spot for harming him. Next action, jump away. Okay. It'll kill me, kill me if I do that. Okay, it jumps away. That's fine. So the big problem, holy shit, is it gonna do more damage? It is. What's it doing now? Summoning creatures, okay, that's good, that's good. Do I hit it? No, let's ignore it. Because it summoning creatures is advantageous for me because I can explode the shit out of them. Keep summoning those creatures. It only heals me. Okay, maybe not this creature. Yes, keep summoning them. Generally, the less explosive, the better. Generally. I can make do. Oh, good. We get a loot boy. Okay, I'm seeing some candles pop up here. Let's grab some stats. Pop that there. These guys hurt. Everything hurts. Oh, these are going to explode on me. I don't know what happens w when I do that, so I'm just gonna... Okay. So he makes certain things hurt me pretty bad. I see how that works. Trait is vulnerable. Ooh. Okay, he's gonna move towards me. Let's grab the Healy Potion. Explode a bunch of things. He's gonna escape from me, that's fine. Now everybody is a bomb. Except for these two. Which makes my life much easier. Yes, summon more! Summon more! Summon goons for which I can slay them. Unfortunately, I need to actually take damage here.
Okay. It says he's gonna hit me. But here's the thing, I'm gonna explode him. Hell yeah! This is a solid rogue roguelike. And just a solid game. I... The beginning always is kind of rough. But oh well. Why did you do this? It was my place as it was yours. Not all paths have many doors. And new items have appeared. Owl is gone, but cannot die. Waiting? Watching? Keep inside. That was an incredibly good run, though. I was ridiculous. Just popping everything in my immediate vicinity and healing off of them, which then hit everything else. Like, I, this is why I like roguelikes. When your build spirals so wildly out of control that nothing can stop stop you and you just become ridiculous. Yeah, the ramp up of the end game is exhilarating when you get all the power fantasy dopamine. It's so good! I... More roguelikes absolutely need this kind of thing, and many do, don't get me wrong, but this for me is the like quintessential roguelike where just everything gets nuts by the end of it and it's like, yes, I am unstoppable, and like almost no other game manages to do this. It's a little bit of a letdown sometimes when I'm playing this just because uh, you spend the first like 15 minutes dying over and over and over again and then you get like maybe the right build. Uh, which is odd. And I get why it is the way it is, and I'm sure as I get better it won't be so bad, but woof. Yeah, if you survive to the end, you're almost always ridiculous. It's a lot of fun. Yeah. This is good stuff. Yeah, and the upgrade scrolls too, and I didn't even utilize them well. I, I could have used them a little bit better. Eh, only a little bit better. And there were definitely some slots that I could have switched stuff around too. Ooh. There we go. We'll at least wander with the new items. Maybe they'll be better. Yeah, we've only unlocked a solid amount. Or we've unlocked a solid amount, but not everything. Collection. Yep. I've still got a solid 42 to go. So we've unlocked daily dungeons, difficulty settings, dark stone, thunderstep, the crow, transformer, insanity stone, screamer, merchant, Dark Pact, and that's that. Cool. Well. Huh. So that's probably one difficulty higher. We can give that a shot. I, I'm up for a couple more runs of this. I'm having a good time.